Today, I will be showing four different paintings. I wouldn't call these my favorite paintings, but these four paintings are what caught my eye while watching the video. First, we have the Night Watch. It was made by Rembrandt von Rizium. It was made in 1642. It is an oil on canvas, and the style is Brook. I might not be saying that right, but facts about the Night Watch. This painting is mostly known for its huge size, um, use of light and shadow, and its perception of movement. This painting has been attacked twice. One's by a bread knife and the uh, other was by acid. The painting was covered around with a dark vanish that gave it the illusion of a night scene, which is also how it got its name, the Night Watch. Next we have the Great Wave of Kanagawa. It was made by Kashishika Hosuke. It was made between 1829 and 1833. It's a wood block print and his style is yukio e is also the same as a wood block print but basically that's what it is that's about this painting the great wave of kanagawa is a part of a series of wood block prints produced to illustrate the beauty of mount fuji the mountain that you see in the back is a symbol that holds great importance to Japanese culture, even today. Hokusai wanted to show all aspects of Mount Fuji's beauty and importance, as well as the beauty of the whole Japan in his series. Now we have The Son of Man. This is by Rene Magritte. It was made in 1964. This is also an oil on canvas, and his style is surrealism. Facts about this painting. The Son of Man is a self-portrait of Marguerite himself. Marguerite said that this painting shows us about humanity. He says that everything we see hides some other thing, yet we still want to see what is hidden and what the visible doesn't show us. Some believe that the Son of Man is a religious painting, hence the, the apple, like the Adam and Eve story. Something like that. Now we have the persistence of memory. This is made by Salvador Dali. It was made in 1931. It's also an oil on canvas. And this also is surrealism. Facts about this painting. This painting was painted amid a hallucination. The melting pocket watches are believed to symbolize the relativity of space and time. And people believe that this painting is autobiographical and that the clocks might represent that his adolescence are fading away because he couldn't remember his past as a kid or a child. 